Yeah, um, it's fantastic to be back at St Mary's. Um, seeing the old faces, it's just a, it's a, it's a cycle of people that keep coming in. But yeah, it's, it is nice to be back to the place where you learnt everything. To score a try is always nice. Um, I suppose looking back on it, um, the day that was in it, it was Brian O'Driscoll's last game in the Aviva, and I didn't even really think about it. It didn't really dawn on me until after the game when people said it to me, and it sort of was maybe a bit of a big deal to get that. Um, and especially we needed extra points if it had to come down to that and it nearly did on the day, uh, the last day of the RBS. So um, yeah, it was, it, was, it was nice to get it. Yeah, I am involved uh, in the school. I, I, coach, I was coaching the Senior Cup team this year and I've previously coached um, the under 14s and they're always sort of getting me down to help with the younger props and stuff like that. So it's nice to be sort of recognised and, and um, I enjoy doing it. Was I always going to be a prop? Um, definitely, yeah. My favourite memories of childhood games were probably, particularly up in the club, uh, there was blitzes every Sunday where you'd play a lot of games. You'd play like five or six games, um, basically one after another. You were up at seven in the morning, um, your parents bring you to like likes of Barn Hall and Greystones to play these things, play these games. So. Um, I suppose and making making your friends with that and, and going to school with them from there. Um, I suppose they're probably the fondest memories of being in the junior school. Tell you something you might not know about me. Um, I'm an okay cook. I'm, I, I'm not. Yeah, I'd be interested in cooking. Um, not necessarily chef standard, but um, I do I do enjoy putting on a bit of a display for people. Probably chili con carne would be my best dish. On the Irish team, I often room with Peter O'Mahony. Um, I came up through the ranks with him. Um, I'd be good pals with him. Um, I'd always sort of hang around with him in the in the camps. We'd go crack together. It's the same with Conor Murray. I would we'd all be the same age, so we'd sort of pal around together. The Munster Leinster rivalry is um, a funny one because you're with them for six or eight weeks during the Six Nations, and 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 you're putting your body on the line for them, and then. Two weeks after it's finished, you're you're in head, head first against them. But again, uh, like my parents have asked me, like, do you, do you not hold back a bit or anything like that? But I think that's the bit of a fun of it. Like, if you get a good shot on them or, or they get a good shot on you, you can have a, it's rugby's the sort of game you can sort of have a bit of a laugh. It's good like that, so it, it's it's friendly rivalry. Would I consider moving abroad? Um, not at the moment because I sort of got my foot in, in the door a little bit on the international scene and I think if you move away that can be detrimental a little bit. Uh, I suppose some players are a bit different in that mould but um, I'm enjoying my time at Leinster a lot and there's good guys there to push each other so I would not, not at the moment no.